Welcome and welcome back at I need help by Cisco. In this example, we have to find the perimeter of triangle ABC and we need to use the property of mid segments. So let's take a look a, a little bit to this problem. We know that D and E are the midpoints of AB and AC. So looking here, we notice this A8, AE it's 8, and since uh, E is the midpoint, that means AEC will be also 8. So that will give me a chance to find AC. Also, uh, knowing that D is the midpoint and AD is congruent to BD, uh, that tells me that this segment DE is the mid segment. And this mid segment of 7 is half of this uh, third side of BC. So basically, BC should be. 14. In order to find the perimeter, the only thing we need to find out is AB or any of these two halves, ADs and DB, because they are the same, right? But the problem we're looking at, it looks like we cannot find it unless we look to the big triangle, the original triangle, which I'm going to draw it here. And we notice this triangle is this angle, I'm sorry, it's 65. And this angle it's 50. So using the property of uh, the sum of the interior angle of a triangle, we can find this angle angle C, right? We know the measure of angle A plus the measure of angle B plus the measure of angle C and the sum of the interior angle of a triangle is 180. And we know A is 50 b it's 65 and c we need to find out we can call it x if you want but let's leave it like that 50 plus 65 is 115 plus the measure of angle c equals 180 so we're going to subtract 115 on both sides and we have the measure of angle C equals 65. In this moment, we realize that uh, the original triangle, triangle ABC, is nothing else than a isosceles triangle because these two angles are 65. So if you notice AC is nothing else than 2 times 8, like I said uh, a couple minutes ago, that will be 16. This is a 16. So obviously, AB will be also 16 because these two sides are congruent. We have an isosceles triangle. Those are the leg of the isosceles triangle. And you notice we have this 14 here. So basically, now we can find the perimeter of the original triangle, ABC. Because that is nothing else than uh, AB, which is 16, AC which is also 16 and BC which is 14 so if we add these three sides of the triangle we get 46 the perimeter of triangle ABC it's 46 uh, centimeter but again this problem it's doable we can finish this problem because we notice this is an isosceles triangle and then that will be will not be doable if you enjoyed this video clip don't forget to click the like button and come back and see square for more help thank you